A long legal battle over a mosque in Troy has finally come to an end. A zoning dispute has hung like a cloud for several years over the Adam Community Center. Place of worship is located on Rochester Road south of Waddles. That's where we find Jacqueline Francis live with what we know about the agreement that was reached. Jacqueline. Kimberly, after years of litigation, the first mosque in the city of Troy was able to open in September. And now that there's finally a settlement reached, they're hoping to put this legal battle behind them. The Muslim community in Troy has waited a long time for a place of their own. The legal fight started in 2018 when the leaders of the community center and mosque bought the building. It took a long time because there was no good space in Troy and because the city of Troy was unwilling to relax any of the zoning requirements to allow them to, to have a place of worship. In March, a federal judge ordered the city of Troy and the leaders of the mosque to come to an agreement after the city's zoning laws were found to be in violation of federal law. The mosque leaders sued for damages, resulting in a settlement of an undisclosed amount. The community is so excited. They're really, really happy to have this place where they can come together and pray. They can have their religious ceremonies. They finally have a place for weddings and funerals in the city. Mayor Ethan Baker releasing a statement saying in part, quote, the Troy City Council embraces the multicultural fabric of our city. We are grateful that we were able to amicably resolve the pending case and look forward to continuing a positive relationship. Faith leaders say they're happy to be home. We have been suffering for as a homeless people for a long time. Now we got a home where we can pray and communicate with our creator. Again, neither side would put a dollar amount on the settlement reached, but the city of Troy did waive their right to appeal as part of the agreement. Reporting live in Troy, Jacqueline Francis, Local 4. Hey, Jacqueline, thank you.